what is up to the YouTube channel? I feel like that's going to get so redundant, so I'm going to try to... I wish there was a way to set a timer. Does anybody know how to set a timer to start recording on the A6400? That's the camera I got with the flip-up screen. Um, no, man, so, you know... In the first video, I talked about how you just have to start and you cannot pay really so much attention to these how to start your YouTube channel video. And then I got stuck. <laughs> I did. I really did get stuck because I remember listening to this girl. I'm not sure her name or anything. Or otherwise, I would drop her deal in the comments or on the whatever. But she said that you want to have a list of content ideas and she like made two videos and then after that she didn't post for a while because she had no idea what to talk about. Although that could be kind of true and then you know they talk about niches and like I said in the previous the things that I'm interested not necessarily focusing and turning to a niche maybe my niche is how to get started on YouTube and try to find your niche. <laughs> that could be my niche within a niche. How about that? Um, yeah, man. So I kind of just wanted to come on here and just like give a little bit more about myself. My name is Byron. I am 31. I live in Arkansas. I'm born in, I was born and raised in Southern Western, Southern Western, <laughs> hang on. Southwest Arkansas. The Swark is what we call it back. I live in the Northwest Arkansas. That's so crazy. Born and raised in Southwest, living in Northwest. And so yes, that is it. I'm pretty much I'm a 31 year old trying to start my YouTube channel. So that is that. And you know, I think I'm, I want to take this outside a little bit, just kind of go outside. All right, so like I said, Southwest Arkansas is pretty much it. I am outside. This is my little whip right here, my 2001 Jeep Cherokee. Um, and that's pretty much it. I just, on this journey of trying to provide some form of content and trying to figure out how I'm going to catch it all, and this is just the way it's going to be. It's going to be painful. It's going to be not the best, but I do want to be a form of inspiration to somebody else who is trying to start their YouTube channel. I think whenever we see people in a similar position as we are as far as wanting to start something, we just kind of hold back, hold back. And then you see somebody that doesn't have a lot of followers and you just see them doing it. And then you're like, I could do that. And so then, you know, that's just the way it is. And then I, it's like, for me, it's like carrying this big old camera around that does it for me. But the only way to do it is to be uncomfortable while doing it and just simply post. Now that I've moved to the outside, <laughs> my lens is falling up. And then there's this woman that's a couple houses down. She's looking like. She's sitting in her garage. She's probably thinking, what is he doing with that camera? I'm filming, lady. That's what I'm doing. I'm putting this content out for potential. I have I have like three subscribers. Appreciate it. I appreciate the three, three subscribers I have. You know, I don't want to say I don't have any because that means I would have zero. But I got three. What's up? Hang on. Lens is fogging up again. Ah, there we go. So yeah guys, that's uh, pretty much it. I'll let you see the Jeep. I do have a 98 uh, Z28 Camaro, six speed. Doesn't have AC, only one window rolls down. Got a lot of work to do in that, but I said this was not gonna be much of a car YouTube. I don't know what kind of YouTube this is. This is finding a niche YouTube until I get my niche and then that is my niche YouTube. How about that? I think that's, I think that's gonna rock right there. And then I want to give some advice, you know, I, I want to explain like how I came about this. I, I read, uh, I've read some self-development self books. I don't read a whole lot, but there are some that have grasped to my attention. The Slight Edge, The Alchemist, 
think and grow rich rich dad poor dad i'm looking to get into uh, some investing uh, books uh you know even economics for dummies breaks it all down makes it very um very understanding and so there i go again looking at the screen that's the number one problem with the 6400 is looking at the flip up screen rather than looking directly into the lens and so now you see me probably like dang this dude been looking up the whole entire time but now i'm looking directly into the camera and so thank you for my three subscribers the few views i have any suggestions that you may have of of a person that's trying to find a niche within you know whatever that might be of course i feel like a niche that you can talk about a lot and ones that you can provide value um so that's just i mean like i said i like cars uh yeah i'm i'm an outdoorsy type of person not not fully i've i've gotten away from it i like to flow i've done fish um i don't fish as much as i used to uh i like food but not much into wanting to be, be a food blogger but wanting to vlog blogger vlog but i would like to vlog some cool spots that i go to and capture those moments um so i guess this is more of a lifestyle of a vlog but i would like to find a particular area that fits for me so any suggestions um i mean it's going to be kind of hard to do it right now since you don't know really who i am until i start really getting into this and documenting more and putting it out and things that resonate and so for those people who want to start a youtube that are overthinking it i was there and it set me back and now i wish that i would have documented all the things that i've done up to this point that I didn't do so the best thing to do is if you don't even want to like post it yet is to uh, just document it and save it just simply document and save and then one day you will have just a mountain of content and so I am happy in one way that I just decided to do this this way um, for an example and then to bring it up from a place of I wish I would have but I didn't but here we are now so now I have to figure it out and be able to bring the content that way so with that being said thank you so much I don't know what you could comment but comments are welcome negative or positive uh, constructive criticism um, and that's about it I mean if you want to like and subscribe I would truly appreciate it uh, other than that, I'm just going to try to keep building it until I earn the likes and the, uh, the subscriptions. So, peace. Hey, and always remember, be unique.